Hello, good evening. Welcome to our channel, Yushi Talks. And today we are talking about Quay Gibbs, the car owner of NASCAR's Joe Gibbs Racing, who dies at 49. We have more details. Please continue to watch this video. Quay Gibbs, co owner of Joe Gibbs Racing, son of team patriarch Joe Gibbs and father of NASCAR driver Ty Gibbs, has died at the age of 49, the racing team announced. It's with great sorrow that Joe Gibbs Racing confirms that Quay Gibbs, co owner, went on to be with the Lord in his, la in his sleep last night. The family appreciates all the thoughts and prayers and asks for privacy at this time, the team said via Twitter on Sunday afternoon. Joe Gibbs lost his other son, Janie Gibbs, in 2019. He died also at the age of 49 after a long battle with degenerative neurological disease, according to Dafkar. The cause of Quay Gibbs' death has not been announced, but he died just hours after his 20-year-old son, Ty Gibbs, won the NASCAR's uh, Xfinity Series Championship race. Quay Gibbs spoke to media about his son's race Saturday following a controversial week. Watching it today, yeah, just to see his determination, NASCAR quoted him as saying, I think he's got the skills and he's determined. It's definitely, it definitely made me proud. I think it made my wife, we were both proud just because he hammered down and did his job. He wants, uh, if he wants to do this for a living, he's going to learn how to do that, he added. Quay Gibbs joined his father's team after finishing a college football career at Stanford University, according to NASCAR. Quay and Jerry Gibbs both worked in front office of Joe Gibbs Racing, and Quay Gibbs also raced for the team, according to NASCAR. The news of Quay Gibbs' death left the NASCAR world stunned on the day of the final race of season. A moment of silence was held before uh, held on his memory before the start of race. Ty Gibbs, who was slated to drive the number 23 car in NASCAR's Cup Series Championship, Phoenix, days away in Arizona, was replaced by driver Daniel Hornwick just hours before the race, with his racing team signing a family emergency as the cause. Danny Hamlin, one of Joe Gibbs Racing's most successful drivers, tweeted, Today we will do what we don't want to do, but we will unite as a family and race for the name on our chest. NASCAR Chairman and CEO Jim Franz said in a statement, We are heartbroken by the tragic loss of Coy Gibbs. On behalf of Franz family and all of NASCAR, I extend my deepest condolences to Joe, Pat, Heather, the Gibbs family, and, jo and everyone at Joe Gibbs Racing on the loss of Coy, a true friend and a racer. That's all we have in today's video. Please continue to watch this video for more informative news. Thanks for watching us. You have a wonderful day ahead. Bye -bye.